What's going on, everybody? It's Cable on Network here, chilling out, Max. Now doing my thing, doing a review of One Piece episode 726, the transformation of Gear 4. Something that One Piece fans have been waiting for for ages. Now it was a big hype on the last episode. In this episode, it took about 10 minutes to lead up to the actual transformation, but it was all the more worth it. Now we actually got to see Luffy's Gong Gun, and we actually got to see some information on Gear 4. Now he developed Gear 4 because he needed some to wrestle giant animals to the ground he had to have something that can fight them his um gear three was too slow and his gear second was fast but it lacked heaviness now with this ability he combined them all four or five times it and he took Doflamingo for a world I haven't seen anybody get punched like that and sit flying after blocking since like I don't know Goku punch cell or Frieza, like Jesus. Now, Doflamingo did his best to try to keep up with Luffy. Now, he managed to um, harden his skin at the points of impact of Luffy's attacks, but it didn't matter. Doflamingo looked like a child compared to Luffy. He didn't stand a lick of a chance. It was basically like um, how Vegeta, Super Vegeta, fought Cell. Actually, no, Super Vegeta stood more of a chance against Cell and Doflamingo did Luffy. Doflamingo couldn't even hurt Luffy. Luffy uh, managed to make his body armored, but still rubber. It was intense. Now, every one of Doflamingo's attacks that um, he made Luffy punch through him in an instant. Doflamingo was on the ropes, and then Luffy apparently developed this new ability called Gumbo Gumbo no Python, and then Calvian. Now, Python, basically, he's able to literally change the, change the trajectory of where his arm is stretching to and he can in all honesty he can lengthen his arm to oh my god unknown proportions though honestly the way he was bending his arm it wasn't as a straight line it was literally like a python all different up down left right side to side and it was still going Doflamingo had no chance against it main thing I'm grateful for that people actually saw Luffy's new ability my main thing was that he was gonna do it and nobody was gonna see it so it was gonna be a secret it would have annoyed me but everybody saw it everybody in the town saw him and then you know Bartholomew he saw him as well going crazy and such it was epic everybody seen him viola actually had clairvoyance so she saw him as well now i'm not gonna lie when he first went into that he, he the way he said fourth gear four that was awesome i gotta say that was awesome just the way he said gear fourth now it was kind of funny because it was bounce man all he was literally doing he couldn't stand still all he was doing was bounce he could not stand still all he could do was bounce around but that um, whole funny exterior turned out to be immense power. He's 10 times stronger than Doflamingo, easily, easily, maybe even 20 times stronger than him. Now, in his normal base form, gear one, gear two, and gear three, he stood about even with Doflamingo, maybe a tiny bit stronger. With gear four, it's overwhelmingly stronger. Like, Doflamingo honestly couldn't do anything, he couldn't escape him. Okay, one punch from Luffy sent off Flamingo flying all the way from the castle to downtown. Now, one of Doflamingo's kicks, Athlete Heal, which was actually a really immense and powerful attack, one of his most powerful, didn't even hurt Luffy. And Luffy even said a crappy attack like that will not even damage me. Like, he basically, wow, he basically humiliated and, how I'll say, demoralized Doflamingo. Put in the comments, what do you guys think about this episode? I want to hear what you guys had to say. I've been waiting for this for a long time to do a review of it. Peace out and talk to y'all.